Yeah, that's nice. A little uh, black spray paint right all over the front of my $600 cell cam. I always really appreciate that. You missed the one that's up in the tree right here. It's always like so sad when you miss that third camera. Nice $2,000 in camera equipment ruined. But that's nothing compared to your life. So I moved here probably eight months ago and I moved out of here probably seven months ago because all my neighbors proved to be probably the stupidest people I've ever seen in my life. So I thought I'd put up some cameras to uh, capture that and we finally uh, got what we needed. Some of these bad boys, these are Apple AirTags now. I have 16 of them. That's all you can put on one Apple ID. We're gonna stick these in the most hidden spots and then hopefully the guy who stole my other stuff takes one of these and it leads us right to where he's taken everything. AirTags need another iPhone to ping off of so the only way it's gonna work, like you can't track the exact location 100% of the time. So his own iPhone is what's gonna incriminate him here. <laughs> You think? How could you? This yeah. guy is stupid. He's yeah, gonna you take ain't. This. He's no. not gonna know. Okay, you get the duct tape. We're gonna put it right there. He's gonna just steal like the jack handle and get caught for it. <laughs> oh, also, just really quick while we're doing this, I figured this is a great time because it's sitting right here and you can easily look at it. Um, this is a uh, Pro Eagle three and a half ton jack. Their customer service is great. They brag about that, but their product is not, and they don't brag about that, and they won't let anyone know. Um, this is a three and a half ton jack. I lifted a two and a half ton truck, and it bent the front axle on every single one of my jacks. I have four of these. The screws came out. This bracket broke. Um, the screw on this immediately broke. Um, every single screw on the entire thing comes out because they don't use um, good screws. Uh, I had to put extra lock washers in them. There's no lock washer on these. Um, the pedestals fall off. Like I said, I already said that. Um, the the um, pistons went out on every single jack, so they only lift one ton. Um, so the wheels are plastic. Um, I don't I don't know what's going on there, but I don't know why anyone still buys these. That's all I had to say about that. So uh, thanks for tuning in to that reverse sponsorship. Yo, this is our guy. Where? The forerunners at his house. <laughs> the forerunners at his house right now in the truck. Go there. We're gonna go there right now. Um, about two weeks ago, I had a bunch of my stuff stolen. I had some storage containers at my property. I knew people in the area kind of stole, but I didn't think my stuff would get stolen because it was like way off the road, like half a mile off the road. Um, and go figure, my stuff got stolen. But I wasn't too worried. I always catch whoever steals my stuff. Um, I had cell cameras up, basically uh, trail cameras that send you a picture to your phone, like a text of what's going on at the moment, like right in moment. Like I can request a picture or get sent to me when someone's in front of it. I wasn't checking on the pictures because one was aimed at the road and there was cars going by every single day but it was capturing everyone that was going in and out and a lot of people go in there to turn around suspiciously and take like a few extra minutes we hauled the storage containers to my other property and i looked inside and i was like where's all my my stuff at like my compound bows were gone there's three compound bows missing uh we were looking for a leaf blower and the leaf blower wasn't in there we found out everything else was missing too there's three tailgates that were missing one off the the red square body we destroyed like sentimental stuff like it didn't even take anything that super valuable so i'm looking through and i'm like there's pictures of the guy going up and spray painting two of my cell cameras like i don't get how you're dumb enough to get yourself like, like there's antennas sticking up like it's literally sending me pictures as he does it um the guy wears a mask the guy puts a, like a medical mask on goes up and spray paints two of my cameras. He didn't see the third one aiming down at those cameras. So I have pictures of the top of the guy's face. I have pictures of his truck going by 60 seconds later. And then I look through it and I have pictures of a forerunner. They, they pulled in and they pulled out 18 minutes later. And you can zoom in on the back of this picture. And I'm like, wait a second, where's my four wheeler ramps at? They're like in his forerunner as he's pulling. You can see the, the four wheeler ramp sticking in the back of his forerunner. So we're like, okay, I'm sure it wasn't that stupid, but go figure he was. And his face matches the picture of him spray painting my cameras. So I don't know how he was that stupid. Like I literally got pictures of him doing it. His face and his neck match the same guy that's in the forerunner and the same guy that was painting the cameras. I don't know why he came back a second time because that completely 
It's this house here. Look, tell me if you see a Forerunner and a, and a maroon F-250. Oh, he put the plates back on. So I find it funny, he's got a gate. Maybe he doesn't want someone stealing his stuff. Do not steal from me. I will I will walk up to your front door. I just want to confirm, how do you know this person has your stuff? I have pictures of him driving in and then coming out 10 minutes later with a bunch of my stuff in the back of his car. And we just found out um, where he lives. So you've gone over to the residence? I'm just here at the road, yes. Thank you very much. Well, that worked out. Um, they wanted me, to, we went to the police department and they wanted me to like file out a report and everything. And I'm like, I know who the guy is. I know where he lives. And I'm like, I, I know he has my stuff. The gate's unlocked. We could go in, but I don't see no trespassing sign anywhere technically. I'm pretty sure he has cameras. I wonder how I'd feel if I went up and spray painted over them. Like where, my own neighbors too. I don't get this. Like someone who's not even like, who's set up halfway decent in life. He's in there, there's shop. four people that live here. I did, I did my research. Nobody could be here yet. Like. Oh, they're they're definitely here. I, I should have said on the phone, yeah, like we're going in right now. We're going in. <laughs> they'd be like, they'd be like, all in ass. To your right, Seth, right there. They're here. Yeah. Um, he sold three compound bows, three tailgates, the four wheeler ramps, uh, backpack leaf blower, and that's all I know of so far. Painting my security cameras. He didn't see this. He didn't see this one. It's up in the air. Literally, my stuff in the back of his car. The same car that's here. This, which one? Um, the Forerunner and then the F-250. Yeah, what all was stolen? Uh, three yeah. compound bows, the four-wheeler ramps there, uh, three tailgates, and then that's that's him. You can see in the Forerunner, his neck is the same shape through the windshield. I pulled up his driver's license on the way over here. Hey, did you, did you file a report and everything? Uh, no, we just found out and got here as soon as... Oh, okay, I got you. Look at him talking. Hopefully it's as simple as a slight apology and we're on our way with my stuff back. Yeah, he, he, they just asked him. They he still, just denied it. Yeah, he did. Straight up denying it. Yeah, his heart's racing. He won't even look him in the eyes. Yeah, he's nervous. This is hilarious, dude. Right in front of his wife, like... <laughs> How do you this, this is well, I wonder if his wife knows about it. <laughs> I, wonder if I doubt it. Probably not. He's like, there's no plate. He just said there's no plate. But the yeah. car's in his driveway. Exactly. Without a plate. <laughs> Did you have a picture of one of the plates? Yeah, I have a picture of the Ford plate. What is it? Um, I heard him say, you don't got no plate. He's like, you don't exactly. have a plate. Exactly. I have pictures of your plate your plate i have your plate pictures of you pictures of your car without have, a plate pictures, pictures of your, your plate. mom <laughs> his wife's trying to take a phone just like inside the whole time oh he's pissed he he's going straight to do you have pictures of this yeah. do you have pictures of that when he thinks he's looking me His wife is clueless, dude. She's so clueless. Look how she's looking at him. She's so clueless. She's so confused. Oh my god. I mean, I saw deer out in the field. <laughs> I mean, that could have been someone else's forerunner and big ass Nick walking out and stealing your. <laughs> He's defending himself driving up and down the road. Like, well, he's like, let me see those pictures of me on camera. Where's the camera? Yeah. He's like, where's the camera? He didn't see it, so he's questioning where it was. Where was, that, where was that camera at? I didn't see that one. This is the most, like, like the vehicles are in his yard. Right they there. In Both of yard. them. I have pictures of him. I have pictures of him and the vehicle. Let him in. Let him in, dude. Let him come look. Oh, they're going in. They're going in. Oh. That's all they needed. He invited them in. Dude. I'm going to get my back. You're telling me I don't have to wait for someone to steal all my stuff to catch this guy? Where was the camera at? Yeah, I didn't <laughs> see the one in the tree. I went up to his door. Yeah. Look, he's way in front of the cops, too. He's like, he's like, 
Kind of run in there and hide him real quick. Yeah. He's like, oh, nope, not in here. Did you, did you have any pictures of him actually taking the stuff? Or just spray painting the cameras? I have pictures of him spray painting the cameras, and then I had the pictures of the stuff in the back of the same forerunner that he was in. Yeah, yeah. Okay, here's what, so far what we've got. I mean, it's, it's the car all day long. I mean, it's the forerunner now yeah. it's with the tag. I mean, it's his. And he said the only thing he ever does is ride around looking for deer, to, but he don't hunt. Oh, he closed his shop. Which makes no sense to me whatsoever. Yeah, no, I mean... I mean, I know that was my stuff in the back of that car, so. Um, let me see what else we can get now. I'll hold it back at you. Okay, thank it's you. It's 110% him. It's him. It's him. This, uh, it's him. <laughs> he shut the door. This is laughable. Yeah, he shut. He shut the door. Mother. <laughs> <laughs> the can't go in. Don't have search Why don't they call more cops? They're gonna get a search warrant. Yeah, but that takes time. I wish they could do that while they were here. They have to work. I'll okay. sit out here and watch. I would sit here all night. Like, yeah, I'll sit here with you. He went inside. You did? Oh, yeah, no, he did. did. Yeah, he walked yeah, inside. he shut the door and walked in. He's in the house hiding. My sh He's got the bows in there. You know, he's hiding the bows under his bed right now. Yeah, 100%. We would, we would have had to wait two weeks for that stuff to even get looked at. Right. This is how everything should be handled. Like, you shouldn't just call the cops and be like, stolen like you should find out what you can yeah and then take it yeah they're not gonna like do this. anything no if say someone no absolutely stuff. not no i'm like i already did the work for them and these all cops are nice up, yeah exactly all they just walk up and get back we told him the process he's uh not wanting to give up not giving any information i mean everything it's yeah both vehicles are the car the ones you've seen yeah, uh, oh yeah but we'll follow y'all down to the property that way we can get you know the rest of the information we explained the process to him. So listen, we're gonna do a report. We're gonna, you know, turn it over to detectives. And okay, sergeant told him, said, you know, I'm almost certain we have enough right now for a search warrant. So okay, thank you. be ready. Yeah, um, it's right down here. Like I said, well, I've turned over CID. They can run a search warrant if they want to and go from there. Okay, thank you. And who knows, maybe I'll change your heart for now and then and decide to call us back out. We had pulled the locking cables out since then, but they're in their cell cameras. Like they were taking pictures of him as he was doing it. We just film everything just for. I'm a YouTuber, so we, we make videos for YouTube. Oh, I know. Yeah. <laughs> we do uh, like off roading videos yeah, and stuff you like got that. To freaking Duramax. Yeah. Is like, yeah, that's crazy. Me. <laughs> yeah. But I drive a Duramax. Okay. Of course. He acted like when this court, uh, sergeant told him, like, listen, we're just going to get a search warrant. And they just want their stuff back. Like, split second, he almost like, was going to say something. And then he stopped. And then, yeah. I'm hearing we put Apple Air Tags trackers all over it, and we were waiting for someone to take him. Again. <laughs> but but I drove by and I saw that forerunner in his driveway, and I was like, well, there he is. <laughs> good eye, I mean, because that's sitting off a pretty good ways. <laughs> all right, back to the value. Imagine being so dumb, you get a search warrant called on you. A search warrant. Now they're going through his whole house. Are the garage doors open now? Yeah, they're in the shop. Is that the red tailgate on that trailer? Back up. They're searching it, dude. Yeah. They got a warrant already. Within 20 minutes. That's insane. That's insane. They're searching everything. I love how this happens so quick. So fast. He's, he's like, well, you're going to have to get a warrant. Okay, we got a warrant. <laughs> um, you don't have my number. Oh, oh that guy stood up. He's getting angry. He's pissed. He's mad. Watch him hit him. Oh. He's taking him somewhere. Oh, what if he's leading what him What if he's... What I'm if he's done. leading him to it? Yeah, he was mad. He stood up. Yeah, he him. stood up fast as shit. Seems yeah, he's up. like... <laughs> really? And started he throwing face? his hands. Yeah, like, he did throw his face. I like, he throw his was face. talking a lot. And then he hands. went back first. Yeah. But he's taking him to it. Oh, huh. This, I've dreamt of this day. Dude, I've dreamt of this day ever since my dad had a skid loader stolen when I was a kid. I was like, if anyone ever steals from me, they're getting Yeah. Is that my tailgate? So, dude, what's the white thing? What's the white thing? Did you see that? Someone picked up something. There's the tote. Is that the tote? The yellow with the... That's the detective. You think it is? Yeah, I bet. No. no, I'm pretty sure that was one of their cars. Like these kids. I don't know. It's a Malibu. It's usually... Someone getting out of the passenger, both, both sides. Oh, sh 
uh, full, three of these. Good lord. Wait, why are they just dressed up casually? They're detectives. You think? Uh -huh. Yeah, 100%. A folder. They, they all got the out. There's three people. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, this That's is funny as fuck. Well, are you updated at all? No. Okay. I think we got most of your stuff. Really? Do you, do you mind not filming for a minute? Yeah. You don't want to. You don't want him arrested for any of this right here. You want your stuff back. I but want my stuff back. We have this. We have this problem right here. He did vandalize. That's fourteen hundred dollars. He vandalized those. Are you wanting? Are um, you wanting like? I I, I, I would you? say, hey, grab me a check for fourteen hundred or uh, cash, and we're good. Sure. Like, okay. And if he gets caught for anything else, I will charge if Certainly. if it helps other yeah, people. Of but. course. Up. I'm backing up to the same guy's house your that phone, took my stuff. Your phone's recording. I'm getting my stuff back right now. Okay. So, just let me know what I can do. Okay. Hey, this is Cody. Cody's stuff. You know, dude, I'm embarrassed to no end. You know, uh, especially for my wife and, and you, of course. Um, and there's not a good excuse. Took two pain pills and drank a beer and just felt like a wild ass kid. Yeah. 60 year old man. I went over there in my truck and I um, drove back and got muddy and I saw those two. I looked over and I saw those big wheels and I got out and I looked down and I said, it's pretty cool. And I happened to look over and the, the doors were ajar on those crates. So I walked over and I looked in and I said, damn, I can't get out this muddy. So just in my head, I'm thinking, I'm going to come back with that old truck right there. Didn't you have it in a water pump? I mean, it's, they had no antifreeze in it drove over there and walked in and those tailgates were laying right there at the gate, the door, and then the fan, and on back was the ramps and it was the cooler, and then the box shirts. And like that box shirts I opened, I said, oh, those are pretty good for night. And I stuck them. And there's no good excuse. And, I, and, I, any, and what you're doing here, I do appreciate. And I'm going to pay for those cameras. Okay. I mean, I, I feel like a freaking I mean, I idiot dude I get like idiot. people go through difficult times like you know like well, I, difficult, I, don't need the, I, I mean I'm, I'm I know there's no excuse here. for it there's up no here. excuse but I'm saying like people have difficult times like I get it but I mean I don't tolerate anyone taking my stuff ever yeah I'm never gonna let anyone, I, I never have let anyone get away with it well like I appreciate if you want to make it even with me I really appreciate that but I, do. But I, I mean I just you know that's sentimental like that bow I, I won when I was a kid I didn't I, like, I couldn't even pull it back I know so, you know I couldn't even I know, pull it back yeah so it's just like you know, there, there's no excuse. I appreciate you, you know, no making excuse. it even, but but yeah, like I don't, I don't really have much to say about it. Yeah, I, I, okay, but um, you know, I just, in, in a way, somehow in my mind, I saw the sale sign, the gate, standing out the road. I thought, dude, they abandoned this stuff. You know, yeah. I'm thinking, why was this thing not blocked? And no excuse again. But it's like I felt like I, would, I made myself feel like I wouldn't do nothing wrong. Yeah. I mean, I, like, I got the picture of you. You had a mask over your face. I did. You took your plate off. Yeah, I'm that never had a plate on. That's got a plate Actually, on now. He does. That's one I stuck on him to drive after I see some plate The cameras were 700 each. That's all he owes me. As long as everything's here, it was 700 each. What did you see? Look at shirts. Two cameras. I took each of them. And a cooler. It was just 700 each. That's what I'm saying. I, there's no excuse. I didn't steal this stuff. This is weird. I mean, it's just like one of those. I mean, are you, go, are you going through a difficult time? Are you. <laughs> I mean, I just. Where's the wing run the strap from there? I just saw it. Right it right just came over me. I was like, the door's up. I look in. I said, damn. What was your reason for coming back and painting the cameras? I didn't even know there was cameras in a friend of mine. I said, you know, there's cameras right there looking over that property. I was like, so you told, you told a friend? No, 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 no. We were talking about something else laying being for sale. And I said, yeah, well, I, I drove back there. I, I didn't see any more of stuff. I said, I drove back there. She knows the camera's right there. I said, no, I had no idea. And that weighed on my mind. So I don't know what the hell I thought paint them after the fact would do. Um, hey, Peyton, let me look in that box real quick. I really want to look at it. Oh, I see. A hundred shirts in there. Um, if there was a hundred, there's still a hundred. Um, just keep it. I'm not. No. I, you guys. No. no. Look, you apologized and gave my. I destroyed that. I destroyed your, your property and I did this. You apologized and gave. Like, I appreciate it. You're not going to steal again. You're not going to steal again. It's fine. Keep it. Keep it. Hey, you did it. I. No, no hard feelings. I just appreciate I did, having I my stuff. Know it. I don't have COVID or anything. I appreciate having my stuff. I did not know it. I appreciate having my stuff. I've seen your videos on Facebook. We watch you all. We watch you all the time. Alright. Thank you very much. Thanks for my stuff. Yes.
Um, I'm not going to press charges or anything. I, you're, I, I doubt you're going to take anything again, I, but I just want my stuff back, so I, I appreciate But thank you for... Thank you for offering. You it's, okay. It it's okay. It's okay. I have plenty. I have enough money. I have... I don't. I don't need my stuff back. I just. I just want it. I just wanted my stuff back. It's okay. Is there anything else you guys needed from me? I just gotta get the rest of this stuff. He's gonna write a property. You should just go ahead and give you a copy of just saying that hey, you got this property back or whatever. Um, you've got my card. You got anything? Get any other issues? Anything that comes up, let me know. Just say I doubt very seriously. This guy's not sure. Okay. All right. Come Come on. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. He said he watched you on YouTube. He you knew exactly that? what he, he was doing. He stole Monster Max shirts. Dude. He knew exactly what he, he was doing. He stole Monster Max shirts. <laughs> yeah. I felt Back. horrible for his wife. She was like crying. Yeah, yeah she was. I mean, that's that. It's he said he said he. He stole the bow and he couldn't even pull it back because it's an 80 pound draw. <laughs> He's like, I couldn't even pull it. He tried shooting it. Hey. Don't steal from me. That's all I have to say. Um, don't steal from me. I will catch you and I will be personally loading my stuff back up. Um, as for my dad's skid loader, there's also still a quarter million dollar reward. I will not be letting those people off easy. If you're the one who stole my dad's skid loader, uh, it was a John Deere 250 with this VIN number here. If you're the one that stole that, um, if you come forward and apologize right now, I won't have to put out a quarter million dollar award to find you. Um, let's make it 300K. It's been a month. No one's found it yet. Uh, $300,000 reward for anyone who finds this $20,000 skid loader. Um, thanks for watching.